Hey, what's good, y'all? It's King Z, and I'm back here on Payday 2 with another build for y'all. So, um, yeah, man, if y'all ain't seen the show, highly recommend it, man. We got the Peacemaker build for y'all. So, yeah, bro, I just started watching that shit. It's 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 buzzing, bro. It's a it's a great show, funny as hell. You got my boy John Cena in that whole like shit's it's it's a, it's a good ass show. So if you ain't seen that shit. You know, go watch that, but yeah, just a fun little build for y'all. Um, use the perk deck I'm not too familiar with. Uh, it uses muscle perk deck, so um, yeah, I'm I don't I haven't used muscle very much, don't know too much about it. This is a lower difficulty type build. I'm sure if you know a little bit more about the game than me and like different perk decks and shit, then uh, you'll could probably make this work on death sentence and shit like that but um y'all know me man i've been saying this for a while i don't really give a fuck about this game too much anymore i just i don't really care to play on death sentence no more i've accomplished everything i wanted to do on this game i've done every heist dsod shit like that so yeah i just don't really give a fuck i'm just playing the shit to have fun and uh yeah playing death sentence all the time just isn't fun anymore i'd rather fuck around on like overkill and mayhem and shit like that and just have fun with the fucking game because yeah trying hard on death sentence all fucking time isn't fun grinding this game isn't fun anymore for me so yeah doing shit like this i actually do enjoy playing this game y'all know i've been fucking i just haven't been playing this shit like i used to you know what i'm saying but doing builds like this and just having fun with this shit like i actually like have fun playing the game so yeah that's good so if there's any like other characters from like shows, movies, games, anything y'all want to see, let me know because that'll actually get me like kind of back into playing this shit like I used to maybe. So yeah, but anyways, um, let's get into this shit. So we'll just go down the list here. Um, for armor, I'm just using two piece suit. Peacemaker don't really have any armor. Um, he just puts on his fucking suit. He, I don't even think he has any fucking superpowers for real. He just kills people and shit. So, yeah, that's pretty much what this build is. So, yeah, we're just two-piece suiting it. Um, we are running first aid kits just because I prefer them over doctor bags. But you can always switch them out uh, in your skills for whatever. So, yeah, first aid kits, just my personal preference. Um, I'll go into the weapons after everything else. For the melee, I just have a buzzer. Um, I guess they did use a chainsaw in there. But, uh, yeah, I, the buzzer is just... Uh, personal preference type shit he didn't i don't think there was too much like melee besides like you know fist fights and shit like that see so, yeah, i just went with the buzzer and for the throwable i did use a concussion grenade uh the only other option was like a frag or a he grenade and i just don't want to use those so yeah for the primary it was a tough choice i had to choose between the thanatos or the ksg uh, so yeah, but I didn't really want to make this like a shotgun build. I didn't want to invest a bunch of points into fucking shotgun skills and shit like that. So I just went ahead and went with the Thanatos. So on that, we have, uh, I, I got this like desert camo. That's kind of what he had. So yeah, we have the tank buster barrel on there. He had a long fucking barrel on his. So yeah, I was going with that. Uh, you can put any boost you want on there. Uh, you know, maybe stability if you want that. Yeah, fucking throw that on there. Shit, why not? Um, charm, that's up to you. Gadget, I mean, if you want one, go the fuck ahead. I have the contractor grip, and I kept the default sight because in the uh, show he was using it like an actual fucking sniper. Like, well, I guess, now, did he use? I'm, I'm trying to remember. I know fucking, I don't want to spoil it. I, I'll just leave y'all to see that shit. So, yeah, Thanatos for the primary. For the secondary, we had to go with the Desert Eagle. Now, his Desert Eagle, it's got an insanely long motherfucking barrel. Um, I, I made it the best I could without making it look, look like with that with that stupid fucking barrel. Um, I forgot what it's called, but yeah. You put any boost you want on there, stability, accuracy, team boost if you want that shit, whatever the fuck you want. Um, I do have the Deagle scope mount on there because I think in some episodes he does have the shit like decked out he's got like dude he, he puts like um uh like he's got the long ass fucking barrel and a suppressor on the deagle unfortunately with um this barrel extension 
you can't put the suppressor on there. So yeah, for the barrel extension, I just went with the overkill compensator. But yeah, on his, he's got the longest fucking barrel you've ever seen on a pistol with a suppressor on it. The shit's like fucking, he's probably got an 18 inch barrel on the fucking Desert Eagle. So yeah, that shit's kind of nuts, but yeah. Can't do that in payday, unfortunately. For the grip, I just have to bling grip, because why the fuck not? Didn't put the extended magazine on, because one, it looks stupid, and two, he didn't have one, so yeah, didn't do that. Uh, sometimes, I think he does actually have a scope on the Deagle. I might have to recheck that, but yeah, I think he does, but for me, I just don't like sights on pistols in general, so didn't do that. For the slide, didn't put one on, because it will take off our compensator, but yeah, it was gonna do the long barrel but it looks stupid and didn't really match up with peacemakers so yeah didn't do that so yeah that is the guns now on to the skills so in mastermind here in medic we got basic combat medic ace quick fix uppers and inspire um yeah if you don't want to use um first aid kits you could change out uppers for combat doctor and get them doctor bags it's just personal preference Inspire, just, you know, it's fun. It's lower difficulty shit. So you don't really got to worry about it too much. So, um, yeah. Was contemplating getting, um, jokers in this build, but I just didn't have enough skill points to make it effective. And it doesn't really matter because, like I said, it's a lower difficulty build. So, yeah, didn't do that. Um, in Sharpshooter, I did spec into some skills for the sniper. I love fucking Grey's builds, man. There's the, they're fun as fuck. That's also kind of another reason I want the Thanatos instead of the KSG. Just because Graze is so fucking fun to use. So, yeah, we have basic stable shot, basic rifleman, and then we have aced ammo efficiency, aggressive reload, and Graze. So, um, yeah, we're going to be killing shit, reloading fast, and killing more shit. So, yeah, Graze is just fun as fuck. I love using Graze builds. And Enforcer, we got aced resilience because getting flashbane is not fun. Basic die hard, basic transporter, because moving bags is not fun either. Basic bullseye, and basic shock and awe, just helping with some little armor regeneration, armor gating type shit. So, yeah. Then we have aced ammo, or not, uh, not aced ammo specialist. In ammo specialist, we have aced scavenger. So, yeah, we get a little bit more ammo. Helps with the Thanatos. The Thanatos doesn't have the greatest ammo, and neither does the Deagle. So, yeah, this helps a bit, a, a little bit with that. Sorry, I can't really fucking talk. It is what it is. Y'all know how it go. In Technician here, in Oppressor. That's the only tree we got. We got Aced Steady Grip. So, we get more accuracy. And we have Basic Lock and Load. That's kind of my personal preference type shit with Lock and Load. Some people, I've, I've seen people fucking complain about it in the comments, like... I don't know, man. I don't give a fuck. I like being able to shoot while I'm sprinting. It's it's personal preference type shit. If you're going to complain about it, just fuck off, dude. Like, fucking switch it out for something else, man. It's not hard to fucking right-click the shit and put it somewhere else, goddammit. So, yeah. Basic lock and load just so I can run and shoot shit in the face. Then in Ghost, we have Ace to Duck and Cover. Just for some little extra stamina, speed, all that shit. We have that. When it's Ace, we have a little... 10% chance to dodge while sprinting. Um, which ain't really much. You could probably unace that and put them three points somewhere else. But like I said, who really gives a fuck? It's a fun build shit. And we got basic parkour there for, again, some extra movement speed. Because nobody wants to be fucking slugging around the map. You know what I'm saying? Then in fugitive. Wanted to get some pistol skills just because the Desert Eagle is like a, is a part of Peacemaker's, you know, shit. So I'm like, fuck it, man. Ah, I get some pistol skills in this bitch. So we have ace equilibrium. So we could draw out our pistol faster. And we get more accuracy. We have ace gun nut. Um, so we get five more bullets in our pistol. And we get an extra 50% increased rate of fire. Which is always nice. One-handed talent ace. Extra 15 damage on that bitch. And then we have ace desperado. So... We get the accuracy bonus, which I don't really give a fuck about, but I do give a fuck about that reload pistols 50% faster. So, yeah, that's nice. And, uh, yeah, that is all the skills. And like I said, we are using the muscle perk deck, so we basically have a lot of fucking health. We're basically a tank uh, with some regen. So, yeah, I thought that perk deck worked good because, well, for one, John Cena plays fucking Peacemaker, and two... 
He doesn't really have any fucking superpowers. He literally is just kind of a fucking muscly tank motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, just kind of works. And like I said, the build's fun. It's it's it's, it's fun to run around with. Like I said, man, I love I like doing these type of builds. I don't really like making fucking try hard DSOD builds all the fucking time. It's just it's not fun for me. And uh, yeah, it is what it is. For the crew management, uh. I didn't really do this, but yeah, I guess just throw on whatever. It doesn't really fucking matter. I'm not gonna go into it like I usually do, cause like I said, this isn't really a try hard build. It's just for fun. But um, yeah, that's all I got to say, man. Sorry if this commentary is fucking dog shit. It's been a while since I've made one. First off, and two, um, I'm tired. So yeah, man, that's it for this video. Leave a like if you enjoyed. Subscribe if you are new. I'm gonna leave y'all with the rest of the gameplay. If there is any, I don't know. I don't know how I'm gonna edit this shit. We'll see, man. But yeah, thanks for coming through, man. Uh, make sure you turn the motherfucking notifications on so you don't miss shit. Leave any recommendations in the comments below. And uh, yeah, bro, I'll see y'all motherfuckers later.